children are scary. Oh, children are scary. <laughs> this week is like the last week of a term where I teach. Everyone gives a presentation at the end of the week. So I'm like, just free topic. You can talk about whatever you want. So I'll share about different presentations my kids did. This one third grader, she's like, I'm so excited for today. She gets up and she goes, this is how you can kill people like Zach. She points at me. Oh, <laughs> God. And she shared different ways to kill people. And she's like, if Zach gives you too much homework, you can kill him with me. <laughs> Santa. <laughs> she's the only girl left in a class of like five guys too. And so they were all like cheering yeah. at the end too. Like, yeah, <laughs> let's kill Zach. <laughs> Screwed men, are you safe? Yes. And see, These in are Korea, children. These are children. In Korea, that's actually a joke. And people don't act <laughs> have access to <laughs> deadly weapons. So it's actually a joke. And she actually okay. never mentioned a gun. She mentioned like poison. She mentioned putting a bomb inside <laughs> chicken muffin. No! Chicken muffin. With those sto uh, stories, I'm going to jail. Why am I going to I jail? I think the stories that children are going to jail. <laughs> yeah, I think Scootman's the victim here. I'm the victim. The big swig's one hit. I so much homework, they're mad at me like that. Oh, what? Speaking Ooh, of that sounds rough. One of my students got up and he's like, this is how you Minecraft. Just explained everything he knew in English in Minecraft. It was adorable. And it was also his best ever presentation. So it just proves if you talk about what you like, oh, you're going to sound better. Right I told you about the first student and I have three student presentations to actually share about. I'm trying to remember what the other one was. Oh, he got up there and he goes, today we're gonna learn how to do the toka, toka. You know the that song, that meme. No. You don't Let's know the, the toka, toka? But it's like they mix a bunch of like Japanese anime dances together. <laughs> you, guys, you guys don't know the toka, toka. Anyway. <laughs> and you okay. Shadow Moses. They don't know the Toka meme. No, They're I such don't a know. rumor. I think the Toka is like a verb in Spanish. Anyway, for these third graders, they like, you know, to get up and move around. Oh. And so I will like slap my butt and I'm like, you need to put your booty in your chair. So for that part of the dance, he goes, next, shake your booty. And it was like the sassiest thing I've Astro. ever <laughs> heard a third grader say. And it was hilarious. Jesus. I can't believe you guys don't know the Toka meme. Yeah, man, I'm three years Toka old. Meme. <laughs> It's just a lot of butts. It's like half butts in this meme. Well, you know, you like... With that. <laughs> <laughs> the next student gets up after the Toka Toka dance and he's like already laughing and having fun because he, you know, first friend was like, kill Zach. And then another one was like, ha oh, Toka Toka. It's Elemental the kid that friends. like gives the extremely like normal presentation. Mm, this one was, these are my favorite Pokemon in Y. But he brought uh... like his super laminated Pokemon cards and was like, I don't even know the Ow. names of the Pokemon because he said them in Korea. And his friends were like, <gasps> that's shit. He bought one, like the $100 card that he brought in. He like told different people, like this is a fighting dragon type. So make sure to use it against these types of Pokemon when you're battling. Oh, Trying it's to a fun trip to make some things. Explain how big the US is, like in a book. Oh, they moved from Montana oh. to Alabama. And they're really like, good. oh, they just moved in one country. I'm like, Korea's tiny. No. They yeah. probably drove for four zero hours. And they're like, what? Four zero <laughs> hours? And I'm like, yeah, <laughs> they're still in the United States. They're, they're like, like, not no. four hours? Not Wait, four hours for zero? America's too big, make it small. We need to get Doofenshmirtz on the case. We must shrink the state. Clay. Behold, yeah, no, I, my I shrinkinator. Stuff. Everyone is tired of driving in the United States. Now we can just walk and we don't have to pay stupid insurance policies on it so I can afford Yay! more dastardly plans. Thank you for listening, Perry the Platypus. I feel like you're my only therapist here. But now <laughs> I shall that's, shrink that's the that's entire tri-state area. Oh my goodness, I have another story from school. It was my last week with some of the kids. So I have these reflection questions I ask classes that are like moving on to other teachers. Like, what will you remember about Squidman or Zach? What will you remember about the class? And then the other teachers do this thing. I wish that Zach did this thing that other teachers do. This is what I wish Zach would not do. And this is what I wish he would do more of. And so one of my fourth graders, I've had them since the beginning of third grade. They instead like, <gasps> I know what I remember about Zach. And they like wrote it down and they were super excited. I'm like, dang, what is this? And I go over and look at their paper and it's Zach went in the girls bathroom. Oh, oh. no. And I was like, what? They're like, yeah, I failed my vocab quiz, but you went in the wrong bathroom, ha! Oh, <laughs> no. I had got food poisoning and I had like no water. So I like went in the wrong bathroom. And I told them that story because they were all depressed about not getting a couple of vocab questions right. But they're gonna remember right. that forever, apparently. I'm not a girl. I was throwing up. I had no water in me for 10 hours. And so when I checked out of my Airbnb in Busan, I needed to throw up again. And I just saw bathroom and subway station was like, all right, 
right, this is where I'm going. And I just ran in and hurled. And when I turned around in the stall, I saw a girl. Thankfully, the lady like, was, like, very nice and, like, saw that I had puked and helped me instead of reporting me to the police oh, well. to make me pay a big fine. That's nice. You know it's classist when um, you do something bad, you just pay a fine. Yeah, right.